Imagine this. The year is 1899. Deep in his laboratory in Colorado Springs, Nikola Tesla sits alone, surrounded by the hum of his electrical experiments. The room is dimly lit, except for the occasional flicker of massive sparks dancing through the coils of his machines. The air crackles with static energy as Tesla's mind races, lost in thought. On his cluttered desk lies a worn notebook filled with cryptic symbols, calculations, and strange patterns. His fingers move instinctively, scribbling down the same numbers over and over again, three, six, and nine. To him, these were not just ordinary numbers. They were something far greater, something profound. As the night deepens, Tesla looks up at the sky, watching the flashes of lightning illuminate the dark horizon. He whispers to himself, almost in a trance, if you only knew the magnificence of three, six, and nine, then you would have the key to the universe. But why was Tesla so obsessed with these numbers? Was he onto something groundbreaking, or was this just the eccentric musings of a brilliant but misunderstood genius? Could 369 truly be the code of the universe, unlocking its deepest secrets? Or was it all just an elaborate coincidence? One thing is certain, Tesla's fascination with numbers, energy, and frequency was not random. He believed that the universe itself was built upon fundamental mathematical principles, and that three, six, and nine were the keys to unlocking its hidden truths. So, let's embark on a journey into the mind of Tesla and uncover the mystery of 369 together. Nikola Tesla was more than just a brilliant inventor. He was a visionary who saw the universe as a grand, interconnected system of energy, frequency, and vibration. To him, numbers were not just symbols. They were the very fabric of reality, the hidden language of nature itself. And at the heart of this cosmic code, he believed, were three numbers, three, six, and nine. Tesla was fascinated by the patterns that repeated throughout nature, science, and the cosmos. He saw three, six, and nine everywhere. A circle, the most fundamental shape in existence, has 360 degrees, three plus six equals nine. Electricity, his greatest area of expertise, operates through three essential charges, positive, negative, and neutral. The Fibonacci sequence, which dictates growth patterns in everything from flowers to galaxies, often aligns with these numbers. Even the orbits of planets, their cycles, and the way celestial bodies interact all seem to follow mathematical structures tied to three, six, and nine. For Tesla, these were not coincidences. They were clues, fragments of a larger universal puzzle. He believed that everything in existence moved according to specific vibrations, and these vibrations followed precise mathematical principles. If you want to find the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration, he once said. But was he right? Are three, six, and nine truly the keys to understanding the universe? Or was this simply the mind of a genius seeking patterns in the chaos? Was Tesla on the verge of discovering something profound? Or was he lost in his own obsessions? The mystery of 369 remains. But one thing is certain. Tesla saw the world differently. And sometimes, it is those who see differently who unlock the greatest truths. What is the 369 technique? Today, Tesla's fascination with 3, 6, and 9 has evolved into a powerful mental and spiritual practice known as the 369 technique. Rooted in the idea that the universe operates on frequencies and vibrations, this method is widely used for subconscious programming, mental clarity, and energy alignment. Many believe that by harnessing the power of these numbers, one can amplify their intentions and manifest their desires more effectively. How does it work? The 369 technique follows a simple structure based on repetition and focus. Step one, set a clear intention. Decide what you want to manifest. This could be health, wealth, love, success, or inner peace. Your intention should be positive, present tense, and specific. Step two, use the power of repetition. Write or say your affirmation at specific times throughout the day. 
three times in the morning to set the tone for the day, six times in the afternoon to reinforce your focus, nine times at night to embed it into your subconscious mind. Step three, stay consistent for 21 days. Like any habit, this technique requires commitment. By repeating your intention over a set period, you reinforce it in your subconscious, aligning your thoughts with your desires. I attract wealth and prosperity into my life. Morning, write it three times. Afternoon, say it six times. Night, repeat it nine times. This seemingly simple process taps into the subconscious mind, which operates largely on repetition and emotion. By focusing on a specific goal with intention and belief, many people report experiencing positive changes in their lives. But is this just a psychological trick? Or is there something more profound at play? Could it be that Tesla was right all along? That three, six, and nine truly hold the keys to the universe? Is this just a spiritual belief? Or does it have scientific backing? Neuroscience and psychology suggest that repeated thoughts shape our subconscious mind. The brain learns through repetition, constantly adapting and rewiring itself. The brain is not a fixed structure. It continuously changes and reshapes itself. Repeated thoughts strengthen neural pathways, influencing how we perceive reality. According to quantum physics, everything in the universe is made of energy and vibrates at a specific frequency, including our thoughts. The subconscious mind absorbs repeated affirmations, gradually altering deeply ingrained belief systems and creating new perceptions of reality. Thus, the 369 technique can be seen as a blend of neuroscience, quantum physics, and subconscious reprogramming. Nikola Tesla's fascination with 3, 6, and 9 was not random. He believed that nature followed a hidden mathematical code, and these numbers were at the heart of it. His research hinted that the fundamental structure of the universe, energy, frequency, and vibration, was deeply connected to this pattern. The Great Pyramid of Giza and other ancient structures are built with dimensions that reflect these numbers, suggesting an advanced understanding of sacred geometry. The Fibonacci sequence, the golden ratio, and fractal patterns, all essential to nature's design, frequently align with 3, 6, and 9. Tesla studied frequencies like 4, 32 Hz, and 528 Hz, which are believed to influence human consciousness and healing. When reduced numerologically, their sums often equal 3, 6, or 9. Tesla may have uncovered the rhythm of the universe long before modern science began to grasp its full significance. Perhaps these numbers are not just mathematical curiosities, but keys to unlocking deeper truths about reality itself. If you want to integrate the 369 technique into your daily routine, follow these steps. Define your affirmations. Clearly state what you want to manifest, whether it's success, love, health, or abundance. The more specific, the better. Practice daily repetition. Say or write your affirmation three times in the morning, six times in the afternoon, and nine times at night. Consistency is key. Visualize success. As you repeat your affirmations, imagine your goal as if it has already come true. Feel the emotions of achieving it. Be patient and trust the process. Change doesn't happen overnight. Keep practicing, stay positive, and believe in the power of your thoughts. By committing to this technique, you may begin to notice remarkable shifts in your mindset and reality. So here's the big question. Was Tesla's obsession with three, six, and nine just a wild coincidence? Or did he actually stumble upon some cosmic secret we've yet to fully understand? Could it be that these numbers hold the key to something deeper, something beyond the physical world we know? Maybe Tesla was onto something bigger than even science could explain at the time. Now it's your turn. What do you think? Would you give the 369 technique a shot and see what happens? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. I'd love to hear your take on it. After all, understanding the universe might just be about tapping into the right frequencies. Thank you very much for watching and listening. Hope to see you. Goodbye.